devastated, gutted. I was hysterical. I was crying. I couldn't imagine how somebody got into the rally. First of all, I didn't know all the details. So I couldn't imagine how somebody got into the rally with uh, a gun. Considering when I went to see him in the Bronx, I practically had to strip naked to get in. I couldn't imagine. And then when I heard he was outside of the rally on a rooftop, uh, I was just like, I said, this has got to be a conspiracy from the Democratic Marxist I know, Party. Yeah, I think we don't know the whole story. I'm very suspicious about everything that, that happened last night. And I'm devastated that innocent people died. I mean, I'm, I'm glad God was with Trump. He survived. Thank God he's with us. He's our last best hope to save this country. But but I just, um, I, I, I am devastated that the, the innocent working class people died. But I'm glad they killed the son of a bitch. He got what he deserved. Donald Trump! I love you, Donald! You're here and you're alive! God bless you! God bless you! definitely just won the election and if not the people are gonna know they stole it second of all the fact that he got up I didn't realize it until I got home that they were trying to give us that Zapruder film moment of the Kennedy assassination live on television for 80 million people to watch and they would have scarred your children scarred your family and your nation for years to come like they did with Kennedy and I'm just so happy that they didn't get that moment and I hope Donald Trump gets Kennedy's head and his head carved into Mount Rushmore. Trump 2024. New York City silent no more. We love you. And crown thy good with brotherhood from sea to shining sea. God bless him. 
what happened yesterday? Sure, I, well, I'm not surprised. You know, as a person who's always has been terrorized for seven years, I'm surprised nobody's taking a shot at me. You know, so I'm really not surprised. You called somebody a Nazi enough times by enough people, by enough news agencies calling Donald Trump a Nazi, someone's going to take a shot. And it finally happened. Somebody with enough guts on the liberal side, finally somebody had guts to actually do what they say we're going to do. Unlike Madonna and other comedians and other pundits who said they want to kill Trump. You know, someone actually took a shot yesterday. You saw Melania's uh, statement today? No, I didn't. Oh, okay. She basically called for unity and we can get past it. Okay, yeah, no. Oh, yeah, I got one. What do you I got one for that one. Unity? No. No unity. Forget unity, okay? I understand if you don't, if you're not outside wearing a MAGA hat every day, you don't have to experience all these disgusting Democrats. I get it. You want unity. Okay, but if you want to see what it really looks like, what these people are really like, put on a MAGA hat, go outside anywhere in America and see if you're going to get unity. They want unity without a MAGA hat. They want unity without Trump. And even, you know, and even Melania, it's really nice of her to say things like that. She doesn't wear a MAGA hat either. You know, she's living in the gold tower and I respect her to death. But unity is never going to happen. Um, I mean, okay, so I don't think we need any investigations. I don't think we need to do anything in the congressional hearings. None of it, because none of it works. All it does is slow down the inevitable, and nobody gets fired. So all we have to do is get people outside on November 4th or 5th or whatever day it is. Well, actually, actually November 4th to December, whenever they end the voting for the Democrats and vote and knock on doors and, you know, put on your MAGA hats and put on flags, you know, show people that you're strong, that you're brave, you know, you know, and, and do what you have to do to get this man elected in November because that's all that matters. Nothing else matters. Yeah, where are the drones? Where, where's the, uh, the oversight? It's, it's oversight. Trump, I was with you in 2016. You told me to go home and watch Network. I thought you were crazy, but I did what you asked me and I watched it again. The news media is propaganda and we're coming for you legally and lawfully. Trump, get well. We love you. Mary from New York loves you. Thank you.